Hello, you are welcome to my channel. My name is Glory. If you are new to this channel, I say welcome. If this is the first time you are seeing this channel, I welcome you. Today, I want to speak on another interpretation. I want to speak about the meaning of abortion in the dream. Having abortion in the dream and miscarriage in the dream, they have two different meanings. I have a video about miscarriage in the, uh, you can check that out, spiritual meaning of miscarriage in the dream. This one is talking about having abortion in the dream. What does it mean? And also, I will be replying to some comments that were sent to me concerning the dream they had. So let me go into what is the meaning of abortion in the dream. I, having abortion in the dream is not a positive dream at all. The first meaning it stands for is going against the will of God. If there's anything, anybody that have this dream, God may be showing you that whatever you are doing at the moment, you are going against the will of God for you. You are doing things that you are not supposed to do. God can use dream of having abortion to speak about that. And I always say that whenever you have any dream at all, just try to pay close attention to details that happens around that dream. It will give you the meaning of the direction that God is talking about. That it will be easier to be able to explain where your own case is coming from. So in this case now, going against the will of God, that is the first meaning of having abortion in the dream. Also, another meaning that it has is self-destructive. It's, it's the same thing, it's almost the same thing like going against the will of God, but this one, you are actually doing things that is wrong for you. Like for instance, now, God can show you that dream if you are somebody, you are taking, you are not supposed to take alcohol and you are doing it. God, or t I'm just using it to give you an example of being self-destructive, what God may be speaking to you about in the dream. So if you are doing something that you you know that you are not supposed to do and you are doing it, God may be showing you this that it is not good for you and uh, that is not the right path to take. So God can use that to speak to you. Another meaning that abortion has is plan will not work out. Whatever plan that you are doing at the moment will not work out, will not favor you. Any plan that you are doing, like aborted plan, aborted effort, whatever you are doing at the moment may not work out. Also, the details will let us know in what area that that is going. It can come in area of relationship, in your work, in your business, just or maybe friendship that you have. It's God can use that abortion to say whatever that thing is, it may not work out. Another meaning of uh, abortion is you are planning to take on a new idea, new plan, new thing. And uh, maybe you have to check very well, ask for the will of God for the new thing you are about to do or the new thing you are, the new project you are about to take. You have to find out from, uh, find, find out from God whether it is the right thing for you to do. God can use that abortion to speak about you. Having a new plan, having a new idea, is it the plan of God for you? You have to check out and know because some things that we do may not be the right thing that we should do. Also, it can mean God is bringing change into your life and you are resisting that change. Like something new, but you are reluctant in changing what you are doing. You are comfortable with what you do. You don't want to move ahead and try something new. God can use the dream of abortion to speak about that. That whatever you are doing, you are you are reluctant in change, and God is bringing about change, and that change can be a good thing for you at the at the long run. But you don't want to take that step of that change because you are comfortable with whatever you are doing at the moment. Also, you can speak about your spiritual life. Having abortion in the dream can talk about your spiritual life. It can speak about having setback spiritually. When I say setback spiritually is maybe things you do before spiritually, that is 
having connection with God, being close to God, you are not doing them again. Or you are no more as close to God as you should be. Or in whatever way that you speak to God yourself, in whatever thing you do, you are no more into that. So God can use abortion to speak to you that something is wrong, something is, you are, you are stopping something that is actually good for you. At this time, if you have this dream also, whatever thing you are doing like project, don't stop it because God is showing you that you can abandon whatever you are doing at the moment. It can be abandoned project or you can abandon anything that you are doing at the moment. God is speaking about you keeping up and continue whatever you do. Move up with your efforts in life because if you stop, it's like abortion too. Also, even though, even in that area that is speaking about whatever project you are doing, that is why I say details of dream matters. Details tell you, differentiate what it means to you. And to some people, it may be that uh, whatever they are doing at the moment, they should not stop. In some cases, it may be that you should, you should be very careful at taking new things because Whatever you may do now may not work out. Whatever you do now may not go well. That is why details matters. It will differentiate between what it means to you or what it means to another person. Also, the dream of abortion in some area, it can mean that you will lose something very special to you. You will lose something important to you. You have to start praying against loss. Something that can hurt you at the long run, something that you are attached to, you may lose it. You have to pray against loss. Also, this dream sometimes can mean earth challenges. It can, there may be problem in the area of earth, so you have to be careful. You have to start praying concerning it, that God should come in whatever way that this abortion dream is coming, that the Lord Almighty should stop it if it is on the negative side. And financially too, you have to start praying because it may cause, it may mean financial loss, economic loss, something of that nature in business that you do. It may mean that, and another one I want to speak about is if you, have, if you see someone that you know have abortion, your friend have abortion, God is showing you that this person is in need, this person is has problem. This person has problem. It may be financially, it may be in another area. God is show, showing you that this person lack. This person is going through loss in one way or the other. All those are things that you should pay attention to when you have this dream. And as I always say, if you have dream, whether good or bad, it does not matter that the bad must happen. Or even the good one, you still have to pray for it to come to manifestation. So if you have bad dream, you can pray against it, you can cancel it, and you don't need to worry about that. God Almighty will take care of it if you continue to pray and cancel any bad thing that is happening. Now for you to know it again, as I say, pay, pay close attention to the details and God Almighty will tell you where he's speaking about. And also if you have this abortion and you have it in another way that I did not mention, you can leave it on the comment section below. I will see comment and answer it. And now I want to speak about somebody that sent a message about having abortion to me. This person said in the dream that she saw that her friend that she knew very well, that the friend was pregnant in the dream. So the next thing, the friend invited her that she should follow her to where she want to go and do abortion. And she was trying to stop the friend in the dream not to do the abortion but the friend was insisting that they must go she wants to do the abortion so eventually she followed the friend to the place and while they got to the hospital she woke up if you are the person that wrote this i'm addressing it now what that thing is talking about is actually speaking about your other your friend whatever that she's doing now you can pray on her behalf if it's somebody that you are in contact with, you can speak to her too about it. That whatever she's doing now, God is showing her 
that she's trying to go against the will of God. She's trying to do things that eventually we alter. Also, I always say that God can speak to you in the third person. It means that God can naturally be talking about you to yourself through seeing another person. So God can be speaking about you too to yourself. So check yourself. Is there, is there anything that you are doing now that you, you may know that is not the will of God for you? Check it or you pray more about it. God will reveal more to you concerning it. Another person wrote to me and said she had a dream. Now in the dream, she she in real life she have this boyfriend, and they are so close together. But in the dream, she was telling the boyfriend that she was pregnant, and the boyfriend was telling her that she have to go and abort that pregnancy. And uh, she woke up. What does it mean? Uh, what that one is speaking about? It can mean exactly that you have to be careful. Maybe in real life, you may get pregnant for uh, this person and he may actually say that you should abort it if on the other side god can use it to speak to you consigning the relationship with this man that you're having if it's a marriage if it's a uh, relationship that you believe that can lead to marriage god is using this to tell you that that mar- uh, that relationship may not work out at the end of the day or the intention of this man to you may not be the same thing as you believe maybe you believe in a long-term relationship with him and it's actually looking for just a short-term relationship with you god is showing you his intention so what you can do is not to confront or fight or anything it is to pray about it and uh, god should show you the way forward in the relationship then be careful also because everything is not about prayer you have to be careful then check out try to know the plan that you have on this relationship because God is speaking about this relationship that this relationship may not be a relationship that will last long potential to end in marriage that is what God is speaking about on that area I will be leaving you in the presence of the Almighty may the Lord of God Almighty be watching over you and take care of you in the name of Jesus every loss in your life I cancel it by the power that lives in the name of Jesus so shall it be in the name of God the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit in Jesus mighty name I pray Amen till next time I see you I say remain blessed in Jesus name bye bye bye